Hi, today I'm going to talk about how to clean up your Xbox 360. Um, we had some problems with the Revolution, Call of Duty Revolution DLC. The gun, the Peacekeeper, wasn't available to everybody on our family account. Um, I went online, I was researching it, and it was some people were saying it was a gamer tag issue, kind of like everybody, every gamer tag on my account would have to buy the DLC to, in order to get the the Peacekeeper, but I called Xbox Live. He had me do a couple things to my um, Xbox, and we got it fixed. So it didn't require um, purchasing anything extra. So I'm going to go over how we did this. The first thing I had to do was clear corrupted files from my hard drive. Then I had to clear the system cache. Then I had to delete the season pass and the revolution um, uh, download reboot the system and then I reinstalled <coughs> the season pass and the revolution and like I said we were good to go okay so in your Xbox you're gonna go over to settings and you're gonna come down to system settings press the A button from here you're gonna go down to storage hit the A button and you're gonna be at hard drive hit the A button okay what you're gonna do each of these categories has all kinds of files in it and you're looking for corrupted files. A corrupted file is going, instead of an icon on the left, it's going to have a yellow circle with an exclamation mark in the middle of it and the text is going to say corrupted and it's really easy to see it when you see it. So what you're going to do is go into every one of these categories. So we'll start with games and apps. Okay, I have something called Avatar Editor. So I'm going to hit A and there's three files in there. None of these are corrupted. See where it says Avatar Asset, Refresh Cache, Outfit 1, Reach. In place of that text, on that line it would say corrupted, corrupted, corrupted. And then the icon over on the left would be a yellow circle with the exclamation mark in it. And if one of these was corrupted, we would hit the A button and we would actually delete it. Okay? None of this isn't um, corrupted, so we're not going to do that. I'm going to hit the B to back out of that. I'm back out of it. Okay, I'm going to go to the next game. Okay, sometimes there's pages and pages of files, and what I'm doing is I'm looking looking for something corrupted. Hopefully, I won't find anything corrupted. But when he had me do this yesterday, there was a lot of files that were corrupted, and that can mess up with when you're trying to do a download it can not download correctly okay alright so and then after um, the games and apps you're gonna go into profiles you're gonna go into demos you're gonna go into every single one of these eh. looking for corrupted files and deleting them okay so you're gonna go through all of this and when you're done with that, then you're going to clear your cache. Now how you do that is you come back to the hard drive here. You're going to hit the Y button. Um, you never want to select format. I think that erases everything on your hard drive, which you really don't want to do. Okay, so you're going to come down to Clear System Cache. Hit A. And it says Maintain Storage Device. This will perform maintenance on your Xbox 360 storage device. Do you want to continue? You say yes. Okay, now he had me do this three different times. So hit A again. No. <laughs> hit Y again. Come down to Clear System Cache. Hit Yes. Okay, and then you do that one more time. He had me do it three times. And then he had me go in and delete um, the revolution, which we were thinking maybe it didn't get in there good. Okay, so um, from hard drive, you can go back there again and games and apps and this was a Call of Duty Black Ops thing so I go to Call of Duty Black Ops 2 hit enter and so first I went to the season pass I hit A and I deleted that off and then I went to Revolution hit A and deleted that off okay so then he had me reboot my Xbox which is just turning it off waiting a minute or so and turning it back on 
Okay, then he had me reinstall what I had just deleted off the two game, the two uh, downloads. Okay, so I'm trying to remember where. That, I believe, is in your account, and it would be under download history. Okay, now this isn't the main account that I'm in right now, so the games aren't there. All the games we download go to one certain file, one certain person on this um, account, which I'm not in. They would be here, and when you went to click on it, um, it would be there for you to download. And if you tried to download something that was already downloaded, it would say you already have this downloaded. But they were there for, for us to re-download. The season pass was like not even a minute to download that. And then the revolution took as long as it did the first time I downloaded it. But <clears throat> after I was done, every one of the accounts on my family account was able to get the peacekeeper without any problem. So thank you very much, and goodbye.